What a treat we have up here next on Shakedown. We got a little sprinkle of Ring of Honor in our next matches. We got Brutal Bob Evans taking on Mark Krieger with Bobby Rogers. And I want to welcome Brutal Bob here to P6W and Heartbreak and Hamlin. Well, obviously, Brutal Bob making his way in, a Ring of Honor veteran, even a uh, extra talent formerly in the WWF back in the 1990s. A veteran of the ring here against Krieger, who's had quite a bit of experience here in Pier 6 Wrestling. Of course, a long reign with the P6W Championship, which he lost last year to Colin Delaney. And now Bobby Rogers is gracing the announce booth. This is step two, ladies and gentlemen. Step two. How many steps are there? Don't worry about how many steps. I'll take as many as I want. Step two. So I guess Cassius Kutcher was step one earlier on here tonight. Here we go. Brutal Bob Evans taking on Mark Krieger here at Heartbreak and Hamlin. Here watching Pier 6 Wrestling Shakedown here on the CW. I just like to thank Bru Brutal Bob Evans for uh, the fine breakfast foods over the year, the sausage, the pancakes, the. Oh, is that the same Bob Evans? Oh, it's not? No, oh, I, don't, okay. I don't know, Rob. Okay. I mean, I know he's a man of a lot of talents. and Based on your around. physique, I figured you probably would know more than I did. I love Bruno Bob on the outside taking pictures. Kariger being disrespectful to the female fans in the audience here. Something that's not new to Pier 6 Wrestling at all. Glad to have Ring of Honor here, Russell, represented here in P6W. Brutal Bob spending a lot of time in Ring of Honor tutoring. Mike Bennett, one of the up-and-comers in Ring of Honor, of course, assisted by former WWE diva Maria Canellis, is now Brutal Bob with the arm ring there. Mark Krieger, though, he's been more focused since being under the uh, management of Mad Dog Bobby Rogers. A little more focused, a little more serious, though you wouldn't tell that from his hairstyle, Scotty Bender. No, no, definitely not. But I do agree with you. He has become a little more focused under the tutelage of, of Mad Dog Bobby Rogers, who's his return here back in professional wrestling, he's trying to make it a big one. He's pulling out all the guns. That's fine, what do we know? There's a connection between Cassius Kutcher and Mark Krieger. The conduit, Bobby Rogers. Scary. And, and Mad Dog at the beginning of the show, he said, I mean, he, he talked about a new era in Pier 6 Wrestling, and obviously I guess it would help this new era he's talking about if Krieger could pick up the W against the veteran in Evans. You see that Brutal Bob just had a cheese stick. Oh, he just blew, blew right in the face of Krieger. Nice arm, bro. Nice head to, headlock takeover. Well, grounding. Mark 
Krieger. Krieger trying to make sure his shoulders don't hit for a three count. Your referee, Andrew Milan. Affectionately known as. Well, you forgot his middle initial. Oh, I am. No, G. G is the middle initial. Oh. I thought you said the last list of his last name, so I apologize about that. Hey, Ginger. His, his middle initial. Ginger. Yes. Named after his hair color. Malin, the senior official here in Pier 6 Wrestling. What a hell of a job he does. Yeah, absolutely. Surely he'll get ID'd any bar he walks into, but he is the senior official. I know, Evans again with that side headlock. Just grinding on the shoulders, on the neck area of Mark Krieger. Krieger trying to Find a way to break this side headlock. Little Bob really got it locked in there here at the Sportatorium. Want to thank all the great fans that came out here today. Brave the cold. Coming out of the winter storm Nemo. Nice 14 inches of snow dropping here in the West been New an York. adventure of travel this weekend, Scotty Bender. A lot of adventure, especially for a lot of the wrestlers coming in from out of town for this show here in Hamlin. Absolutely, absolutely. Gotta love the great sport of professional wrestling. I thought Nemo was like a cute little animated fish. It was a crippling storm. I hate Nemo now. I think a lot of people do, yeah. especially go ask some people out in Massachusetts. Screw that I think they'll fish. agree with you. I know. Now Evans with a front chancery. He went from the side headlock into the front chancery. Still, Krieger trying to find a way out. Oh, oh wait a minute. Well, that woke Krieger up. <laughs> well, tap on the Heine. Wait a minute. He's going for the tag. Uh-oh. I think it's a three stooges. Krieger thought he was in a tag match. What the hell's going on? Now roll up here. No. Count of two from Mullen. Shenanigans. Oh, there goes Krieger to the outside. Yeah. I know Rogers on the outside. Trying to get Mark Krieger refocused. Don't forget to take full advantage of that 10 count. Regrouping on the outside. And now finally, Krieger up to the ring apron. Tell him Bob to stay away. And now Bruno Bob's gonna bring him in the hard way! Flipping him over and not to the uh, liking of Mad Dog. Slingshots him in, now follows up. Front in a right hand. Oh, right hand. And now again, oh, he goes to my ball, and Krieger fires back with the right hand, and Bruno Bob's saying, no, you're gonna have to do a little better than that. And now Bruno Bob just pounding those right hands. Right to the side of the face of Krieger, I was supposed to across the way. Oh, oh my back body drop. Bruno Bob in control. Follows up again with another Irish swim, he comes rushing in. Oh! Let's go over. Kip attack into the corner. Thrust his leg right into the chest of Brutal Bob. Uh, the, hold on. The unfair help there from Woodstock on the outside. That was the name of that bird, Snoopy, right? That canary yellow. Yes. Bird? Woodstock, I got that right up there. Just checking. Speaking of checking, Mullen's making sure checking on that rear chin lock by Mark Krieger. Doesn't slip into an illegal choke. I wouldn't pat it past Krieger. At this point, looking very desperate in this match. Very little offense out of the Krieger camp. The best thing that worked was Bobby Rogers holding the ankle of Bob, Bob Evans. Hold on. Again, maintaining that rear chin lock on Bob Evans. Uh, Krieger 
talking about the fans cheering for him, which isn't really the case. Formerly, he's, he's dropped the every lady's dream. He, he claims to not be focused on the, the women Have anymore. Have you met those ladies that dream about Mark Krieger? No, I'm still <laughs> looking for them. You're going <laughs> to... You might as well pack a lunch. Oh, now Brutal Bob just fired those elbows into the midsection of the Krieger trying to break the hold. Finally, scoops up. Oh, oh wait a minute. Oh, Man just is waiting to cover. No. Krieger almost in the count of three on the vet. Wait, oh. Hold on. Now Krieger with a front chancery of his own. Mullen checking on Brutal Bob here, center of the ring. Making sure Krieger doesn't cut that air passageway out. And now back to the rear chin lock. Back to now bottom feet. up to his feet. Oh, oh nice readjusting there. Oh, but Krieger still hangs on. You gotta well, keep your eyes on Mad Dog there, just following the action of the different sides of the ring, looking for his opportunity to get involved. I want to mention Mark Krieger, the longest reigning P6W heavyweight champion. The guy has some credentials. Of course, he took the belt from Andrew Davis back in 2011 and then lost it in 2012 to Don Delaney, the current champion. Delaney now coming up on uh, close to a year of his title reign as well. And now, oh, Rob put him out, just pawning away, Krieger! Up on the top rope! Hold on. Big. Oh, Bulldog, center of the ring. Hey, count of two there, and you now Krieger again focused here against this veteran. And hold on. Nice roll. Wait a minute. Oh, DDT. <laughs> oh boy. Right from the knees of Bob Evans. Easily knock a man out. Cover. Up maneuver there by Mark Krieger. Had to call an audible as he hit Evans with that DDT from the knees. Now call from the end. Oh! Krieger going for a pile driver, but Bob Evans able to backdrop him. Krieger doesn't know where he is. Shoulder tackle shows him to the outside cover. Two and again, Bobby Rogers. Wait a minute. That's not fair. Lifting that foot onto the bottom rope and see the frustration there from Buddha Bob. He had him beat. Buddha Bob should have been going to the pay window. This match should have been over, but the veteran. Wait a minute, Krieger! He's got his feet on the top rope! Wait a minute, are you kidding oh, me? He doesn't even see it! Mark Krieger steals one here! And heartbreaking Hamlin! Top rope for leverage as he gets the win here on Shakedown. Granted, it's tainted, but it goes as a win in the win column. Look at Krieger, he can't even walk straight, but he picks up the victory. And another notch in the win column for Mad Dog and company. Let's see, he's holding up that hand signal. Is he flashing gang signs? I don't know, it looks like Eric Everlast or something. I don't know what's going on. Well, a nice debut there from Brutal Bob Evans, just unable to pick up the victory, but it's not his fault after the shenanigans from Rogers and Krieger.